Hi Nia, good morning. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Tell me about yourself. Uh, first of all, thank you for giving me this opportunity to introduce myself. My name is Nia Gurve. I am from Barshi. I have completed my uh, B.Tech from Swedish College of Engineering, Pandarpur, uh, in specialization with computer science and engineering. I have deeply interested in data analytics, and I have made three projects using SQL, uh, Power BI, and Python. Uh, my okay. Uh -huh. Great. Uh -huh. So, what is data analytics? Uh, data analytics is the uh, examining. Uh, data analytics is the process of examining raw data to finding the insights uh, to support the decision making. What are the types of data analytics? Uh, there are uh, different types of data analytics. First is the descriptive analytics. Mm -hmm. Second is diagnostic analytics. Third is uh, predictive analytics, and uh, last is prescriptive analytics. Okay. Uh, uh, descriptive analytics means uh, what happened. Uh, for example, monthly sales report. Then uh, la second is the diagnostic analytics means uh, why did it happen? Uh, for example, uh, anal uh, analyze the why sales is uh, why sales is drop out the last quarter. Then third third is the uh, predictive analytics means uh, what might be uh, what might be happen to next. Uh, means uh, forecasting for example forecasting the uh, dema uh, demand or revenue and last is the prescriptive uh, prescriptive analysis means uh, recommended take the actions okay so can you explain what is uh, data analytics life cycle yes uh, first phase is the, the define the problem statement then second step is the uh, data collection data collection means uh, gather the data from the various sources like uh, websites uh, website database and sensor etc then third step is the cleaning uh, data cleaning data cleaning means uh, remove the unwanted and in inaccurate data from the data set then uh, uh, fourth step is the uh, data an analysis means uh, data analysis is used to the statistical and uh, computational techniques uh, and uh, fifth uh, fifth step is the visualization to uh, understand the uh, quickly uh, reports oh, next question will be what are the difference between data analytics and data science data analytics uh, is focused on the descriptive analytics and uh, diagnostic analytics okay. uh, of, for finding the trends and patterns and data science is uh, is data science is also include the analytics but also build the uh, pred uh, predictive and pres prescriptive uh, analysis uh, using the ai and ml great next question will be what is data uh, data is nothing but the uh, pieces of information like uh, uh, data is present in number uh, symbols and uh, images like any format okay type of data what is the types of data basically there are three types of data first is structured data unstructured data and semi structured data uh, structured data means uh, data is present in the tabular format means rows and column format then unstructured data means present the uh, not any fixed structure uh, format uh, and data is uh, present in the flexible flexible format like uh, social media and uh, social me uh, social media uh, documents file or emails etc and semi structure uh, semi structure data means uh, data is present in the keys and value pair for example xml and uh, json file okay fine next question will be what are the commonly uh, tools we used in data analytics uh, there are different type uh, types of tool are used in data analytics first is the excel X, uh, uh, then sql python power bi uh, python r power bi tableau uh, google sheet and sas uh, excel and sql is used used for uh, data collection and cleaning purpose then uh, data uh, python and uh, r language is used for the uh, analysis purpose and uh, uh, power bi and tableau is used for the visualization purpose okay so how can we cleaning the data and why it is important for us uh, data cleaning is the process uh, to uh, reduce uh, to remove or fix or uh, to remove or fix the unwanted inaccurate and inconsistent data and uh, uh, data cleaning is the uh, crucial for the and uh, crucial for the analysis uh, accurate analysis okay so how can we handle missing data uh, yes 
uh, there are basically three tips in uh, handle the missing data. First mm -hmm. is uh, remove the rows. Then uh, second is replace with the mean, uh, mm -hmm. mean, mode, and median. And then, then third step is the predictive modeling. There are three steps. Okay, fine. So next question will be: What is data mining and uh, what is data profiling? Okay, uh, data. Uh, first first of all data mining data mining uh, the purpose of data mining mm -hmm. extract the trends patterns and uh, relationship uh, uh, sorry trends patterns and insights from the large data sets and uh, uh, data profiling uh, is evaluate the uh, data quality quantity and co consistency of the data and data modeling data modeling is focused on the uh, uh, data modeling is focused uh, focused on the uh, ten uh, focused on the relationship and uh, uh, prediction and data profiling focused on the uh, uh, consistency and accuracy of the data. Okay, so what are the difference between OLTP and OLAP? OLTP stand for online transaction process uh, processing mm -hmm. and o uh, OLAP for uh, online transaction uh, online uh, online uh, analysis processing analytics processing uh, analytics okay. processing online transaction processing is used for the day by day transaction mm -hmm. for example banking system mm -hmm. and online analysis processing uh, is used for the uh, analysis and uh, reporting for, okay. from the large data set okay. next question will be what is kpis kpis stand for key performance indicator uh, it is way to measure the performance of organization uh, to proceed uh, to process to uh, towards to achieving the uh, achieving the success okay fine now move for mysql okay so first question will be in mysql so many commands are there so what is ddl command ddl uh, stand for data definition language uh, is used for the uh, definition or uh, define or modify the uh, structure of data uh, in uh, there are uh, different uh, commands first is uh, create uh, alter drop and truncate okay fine what are the difference between where clause and having clause uh, where clause is used uh, before the group by and mm -hmm. having clause is used after the group by uh, where clause is using with the uh, select update and delete and mm -hmm. uh, having clause is used with the uh, aggregate function like sum mean max okay what is order by clause in mysql uh, order by clause is used for the sorting the result uh, as uh, ascending order or descending order okay next question will be what is join and how many types of join in mysql joins is used to combine the two or more tables based on the related columns uh, and there are uh, different type of joins first is inner join uh, left join right join uh, full join self join and cross join okay great thank you neha for the nice interview okay